Yes, I mean, I've been involved in many cases under the old law where I felt that for members of a group or gang to be held liable for a murder merely because they were present and, and knew that someone had a knife um, was unjust and wrong. And um, fortunately, the law has now been changed. I recall one case in particular, um, which became known as the Honey Trap case, in which a 15-year-old girl was part of a group on a given day in the background of some minor tiff to do with a boy. And um, she believed that uh, a boy was going to uh, was going to be slapped around the face. Um, one of the group that confronted the boy had a knife and stabbed him. And her case throughout was, I didn't know any knife was involved. I just thought he was going to be hit. But she was held liable for murder on the basis the jury clearly concluded that um, she must have known a knife was involved. She didn't do anything. Um, and that was very harsh. Under the new law, it would have to be proved that she intended very serious violence to be used. And that's the right threshold rather than the old threshold. So, yes, I've seen what I believe to be many wrongful convictions. Hers is a classic example. And fortunately now the law has changed for the better.